Fruity, 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 fruity. Greetings, my beautiful lovelies. It's Emmy. Welcome back to another episode of Fruity Fruits, where I taste fruits that are fruity. Now, if you've missed my previous episodes of tasting interesting fruits, be sure to check out the playlist. I'll put the link there and down below, where you can see lots of videos about fruits that are very interesting. Now, today I'm going to be tasting this, and this is a soursop, also known as a guanabana. Guanabana? I believe that's what it's called or how it's pronounced. And I have tasted this once before. The specimen that I had prior, I actually purchased at Whole Foods and many people left comments saying that was not a good specimen. So I received this one in my mystery fruit box. If you haven't seen that video, be sure to check that out. I paid $150 and got a box of all kinds of tropical fruit and included in that box was this. It is very soft to the touch. It just kind of gives a bit like an avocado and you have to hold it kind of very gently. If you look at it, it gives just a little bit, kind of like an avocado. And these kind of thorns have turned a little bit darker brown and the skin is not as shiny and the green is kind of turned a bit more yellow rather than just kind of that bright lime green. But look at this, but it's huge. This is a much bigger example than what I had in my last video. So. Let's go ahead and give our soursop a taste. All right, here we go. Very, very soft. Oh, I can feel the seeds. All right, here we go. Oh, there it is. Look at that. So immediately I notice a big difference. Last time, this kind of medial vein here had a bit of more darkening in the middle and this example is much more aromatic. It's got such a lovely smell. What does that smell like? Fruity, a lot like juicy fruit gum, really. So the scientific name of soursop is Anona muricata, and it is in the same family as custard apples. Look at this beautiful seed. It almost looks like a giant watermelon seed. Really dark in color and beautiful. Now let's scoop out some of this flesh. Now, look how soft that is. It's so, so soft and kind of custardy, but there is some structure to it. It looks like it's kind of connected to the central vein here. Look at that. Oh, it smells so good. Tropical, fruity, floral, very perfumed almost. All right, let's give this a taste. Itadakimasu. Mmm. Oh my goodness. That's amazing. This one is so much better than the first one that I had. The flavor is so intense and tangy. It's almost as sour as say something like when you eat a Sour Patch Kid, it gives you that much of a soury punch, but the intensive flavor is incredible, completely natural, but the intensity almost feels artificial. Almost like when you're having Hawaiian punch, you're just like, whoa, that's that tropical fruit flavor, but this is natural and wonderful. Mm. Oops, just dropped a seed. That is incredible. I love the intensity of the flavor in combination with that sourness. It's like a Sour Patch Kid. If you're into sour fruits and sour candies, that's what this fruit is like. It's got this very pleasant, sour, tangy, full of flavor. One of my favorite tropical fruits so far. So, so good. Mmm. The texture is very interesting. It's smooth and creamy, but there's a little bit kind of a membrane in there. As you can see, there's kind of little sections or kind of like sacks that there's a little bit of bite to it, but the general texture is very, very soft and creamy and smooth. A little bit of a grain to it, kind of like very finely ground or pureed applesauce. Now that I've had a few bites and think about it, it reminds me a lot of passion fruit in the sense that it has that really intense flavor and really great tartness to it. But of course it doesn't have the same color, it doesn't have the same structure, but a similar kind of intensity. Alrighty, so there you have it, soursop or guanabana. I highly recommend it. See if you can get your paws on one because they're absolutely incredible.
Alrighty, thank you guys so much for joining me. I hope you guys enjoyed that one. I hope you guys learned something. Be sure to check out the Fruity Fruits playlist for more interesting fruits. Let me know in the comments if there are fruits that I should try or that you recommend. And yeah, share this video with your friends. Follow me on social media. Like, subscribe, and I shall see you in the next one. Toodaloo. Take care. Bye. <laughs>